dropped Daniel off at the airport. He flew out to Indiana. I'm driving home by myself in his car. Got thinking, why not stop at Salmon Sack? Beautiful day. There's Lake Ketchikan, really full. I got off at Clay Elm, headed up 903, um, driving that beautiful road. Memories coming back. Remember sitting up in the camper, looking out that window, knowing we're getting close. I bet you that van passed us 40 years ago. On the way into the campground, it's still that one car only bridge. On the way out, I actually had to wait for other cars to go through. I cut the audio, but I was basically saying it's been a long time. And there's not a lot of changes made. Uh, they had new toilets. I didn't see any showers. I assume they have water, but no electricity. I walked the whole park, and I kind of remember us camping in this area on the right side, and we had friends, Italian people, that stayed in the middle. This is the river that was behind our site. I remember that log jam. I'm walking across it. On the other side of the campground was this the river that came from the main river, and I remember this distinctly panning for gold with Sourdough Joe. I drove Daniel's car back by myself. It's loud. My ears are still ringing. I took these photos for him. In any case, the town, I think this is Ronald, hasn't changed much. And this is the Ronald General Store where I was traumatized as a child, uh, where you drove me back there and made me give back the candy I stole. 